Hi guys, Rob 46 here. Welcome yourselves back to MotoGP 21 on the PS5. We're in the MotoGP category. We are with the Sky Racing VR46 team. We got 10th in our first race. We're off to uh, Termester Rio Hondo. I'm hoping it's going to be a little bit better there, but we'll have to wait and see. Please be dry. It's dry. That's good. Get rid of FP2, do FP3. FP1 is wet, but that's fine. We don't need to do that. Right. Let's go qualify. Well, looky here. Had to go through Q1 with Fabio, and we both got through to Q2. Let's see how we stack up in uh, qualifying to them. Not a good exit. This is my last medium rear tyre. So it's not going to be the best with grip. Because it has been uh, tortured a little bit. But we'll still see where we end up. That was good. Through the kink, that's where you can make or lose a lot of time. Oh, we're over the time. Quattararo provisional pole, 35-6. I don't think we have the pace to be able to beat that. But I do think we might be able to get on the front row. Yeah, lost a bit more time there. Oh no. Come on, turn. Lost loads of time there. Okay, fifth. Okay, we're starting in fifth. So second rope. Miller went quickest overall. So, uh... Yeah, we'll see what we can do from second row of the grid, but yeah, happy with that. Right, time to go racing then. So, 38 degrees, hard front, hard rear. Let's do it. Let's go. Second row of the grid. Let's hope we can get a good start. Here we go. Wasn't a bad start at all, really. Can we sneak into the lead? Yes, we can. Oh, steady. Get off me. Ducati, one, two, four at the moment. Good. This is a sector where we lose loads of time usually. If I stay in the way, it's actually Franco Morbidelli who's in second now. Oh, proper hit there from Miller. Oh, and Morbidelli. That actually helped me with the exit of that corner then, going out into the uh, the penalty loop. Wasn't intentional, but... OK. 
Okay. Not stopping very well. No. Very wide. Someone's just gone down. I think that was Marquez. Both went very wide there. We are pretty much back with them. Morbidelli's going to try and go for the lead. Can I sneak through? No. Not quite. Closer this time. Can we get past? Maybe on the exit, yes. Oh, Franco's back through using that sweet handling Yamaha. Come on. Well, Bedelli again got a better run out the final corner than Miller. Go wide. That's me going too deep. Come on, Ducati. There we go. Tough race so far. It's only going to get harder. Two laps to go. Can't quite get past him just at the fast slap the race though. Yeah, you're running deep. I'll cut back underneath. Or well, maybe not. You're going to have the inside for turn two. It's fine. I kind of knew that was going to happen. Oh, 
Thanks, Miller. That's our chance gone, unfortunately. Okay, this is it. Final lap. Where are we going to end up? Rear tyre not in good condition. Front tyre not in good condition. able to get through a miller just yet Not close enough. Where am I? Oh, we got him! We got him at the end! We got him at the end! Oh, okay. Snatched right at the end. That is what you call a finish. Oh, we got a win! We gotta win a MotoGP. Zarco DNF'd. Oh boy. There we go. Jumped up to second place, five points behind Miller now. Jumped up eight positions. That's mad. That is mad. There we are in the team championship. Up to third. And constructors. We are leading with Ducati. So for the first time this season, I don't know, it's only the second race, we go to Part Fermi and we go to the podium as well. Our first win in this team. Our first win on the PS5 as well. It's just something about that track. I mean, this Ducati, it's not the best feeling bike in the world. It's not the fastest either, but it felt pretty good around here. So very happy with that. Tim, uh... Cota's next, which I'm not looking forward to. It's a very front-end heavy circuit. So I'm really not looking forward to Cota. I think we're going to struggle there. I think we're going to struggle there. But we've got to win. We've got to win. That's probably the only win, other than maybe Mazzano, that I think we're going to end up with this season. I don't think we're going to end up with any other wins, to be honest. Le Mans, maybe... But, um, yeah, I think they're going to be very far and few between. So let's enjoy this one while we can. And then we go to Kota, which, like I said, I'm really not looking forward to. I think that is going to be a very, very difficult race. So we've gone from 10th to 1st. That is uh, one hell of a leap from uh, one race to the next. All right, what's happening here? More contracts on the horizon. Some better teams as well. So, Circuit of the Americas, five laps, which is okay. It's dry again. I'm happy with that. Let's do it. Well, this is a surprise. Look at that. 
Right, I keep it in validating lap times. See where we end up if we can do a lap. That wasn't too bad through the first section. See what the split says there. Okay, three temps off. Come on. Oh, we make time up. Now I just gotta make sure we get the bike stopped. It's this sector we usually lose a bit of time. No, we've gained time. Okay. That's a bit of a nice surprise. Come on. What's it going to be? That was good. 2033. Will it last? Hello there. We're on pole. So, looking all right. Let's go race. Right, here we go then. Race time. 30 degrees. Feet in front. Um, it's in soft rear. I don't think so. Go medium. Medium, medium. Has everyone else gone for? Vignaya's gone for a hard rear. Zarko's gone for a soft. Few people gone for softs. Not many people gone for a medium rear, which is a bit worrying, but... Soon find out. Here we go. Okay. Oh, Vignaya's gone down. See what we can do in the race. Okay, we got through the snaky part a lot better than I was expecting, especially for the first lap with a full tank of fuel. Oh, nearly lost the front. Someone else has gone down. Mess that up. Oh, nearly lost the front, nearly lost the rear. Okay. No. Stay with them, stay with them, don't let them get away. So Zarko leads, Miller in second, Mir third, we're in fourth. 
Get into turn one, made a bit of time up. Excuse me, gents, you're a little bit in the way there. Messed up. Take the penalty. Thought Mir was going to go down, then he just clipped the inside curve, but he's okay. He's away with the back of Miller. That was better through there. He got around the corner without being hit. Someone has gone down. Oh! Sorry, Matt. Proper T boned him. He's still underneath me, though. I hate that corner on this bike, it doesn't feel good. Miller fastest lap. Didn't stop. Back past Vinales. Yeah, that Yamaha looks like it handles really nicely around that section. Got a KTM right behind us with Oliveira. This isn't going to plan now. Got that stopped well though. Wide. Oh no. Oh. Try to do a block pass, didn't work. Hate this corner. Just goes so wide. Oliveira, you're annoying me now, and now we're losing more time. I've done it again. I don't like the feel of this Ducati with less fuel in it around here. It felt better with a full tank. It feels very unstable, which is why I am wobbling away with the place at the moment.
Okay. Come on, pull yourself together. we only got one lap after this. better. Come on! Oh no. Stop doing stoppies! Come on. Seventh place it's going to be. Yeah, once I started losing fuel and mass, the bike was just a different animal. Completely different animal. There we go. So we've dropped down to third now in the championship. 16 points behind. Whew, and we've dropped down to fifth. Okay. No part fair, mate, but we've got some decent points, so that's okay. Right. I think it's time to... Uh, well, we've got a new frame upgrade now. So let's put people onto frame again. So Portomayo will be next, but uh, that'll be next time. Let's look at the standings for all three categories. Moto3, it is Pedro Costa leading that from Darren Binder still. He's got a big lead now, 27 points. Sergio Garcia is third. Joan Mazia is fourth. And Gabriel Rodrigo is fifth. Moto2, it is Sam Lowe's leading from Gardner in second. Digi third. Bezeki fourth. And Arbolino fifth. And MotoGP, it is Miller from Zarco from myself in third. Alex Rins is fourth. And Oliveira is in fifth. Anyway, guys, that is it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave this video a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel for more content. We'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to stay safe, watch hands, look after yourself. See you guys next time. See you!